Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Plays. Welcome back to the land of Game Dev Tycoon at Distress Bacon, Office of Gaming Awesomeness. We're about to make Napoleon the Giants, because obviously Napoleon was a giant. Alternate history, RPG, play system, upbeat tomato. Let's do this. This is our first game for the play system. This is going to be an amazing game. You're going to love it. You'll love it. I think after this, we'll hire someone new. All right, what do we got? This is an RPG game. What do we need for RPG? We need almost minimum, almost max, max. Almost minimum, almost max. Like this. Everything fits? Yep, everything fits just fine. Who wants to do the work? That is the question. Do we need dialogues? We do. Dialogues are supremely important, so I don't really want Chris going nuts. Um, you know what, though? 40% is probably fine. Yeah, I think 40% is just fine. Uh, so go ahead and go nuts, Chris, and then on the next phase, we'll have him just do the dialogue. That'll be fine. Do we want Manuel over here in Story and Quest? I think we do. Yeah, he's not good at it, but what the fuck else is Manuel going to do? <laughs> and if you guys uh, want a good laugh, go to YouTube and look up Manuel the Pool Cleaning Robot. It is fantastic. It's one of the best videos on YouTube. And if you disagree, you're just wrong. I feel bad for you. Oh, look, we have hype already. Neat. We haven't even done anything. We already have hype. They're like, oh my god, are they making a game about Napoleon? I love them. All right, maximum, almost max, and medium. Looking good. Everything fits. And uh, Chris is going to get his work in. Dennis is going to do all this crap. And then Jeremy's going to do the last phase. Perfect. Looking good, man. I think the way we have this team organized is getting a little better now. Little marketing, please. Little marketing, please. Extra marketing, please. Uh, I'll have a marketing with fries, please. We really don't need to do a, too much marketing because... Oh, shit, Mature is popular. Fuck. I didn't realize Mature was popular. I'm a dum-dum. We really don't need to do too much marketing because this is a published game. Okay, these are fine. Let's go. It's a published game, so the publisher will do almost all the marketing for it. So whatever hype we get gets added to their own whatever they do. But, you know, a little bit helps, right? Wow, only 10 bugs? I think this is the game they've made with the least bugs. I'm impressed. 3 million from Shivshank. Not bad. And that's definitely a design record. Oh, both records. Wow, nice. Oh, yes, scores. I forgot to say scores. My bad. Here come the scores. Oh, my God. Everyone's blah, 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 scores. <laughs> Salary increases, okay. Special training for Chris. We can also research Easter eggs. Let's go ahead and hire someone. Dun, dun, dun. You're gonna do some research. Sequels, yeah. Now, do I wanna train you or fire you? You know what, I think this time we're gonna keep our whole crew. This time we will not fire anyone ever. We're gonna keep our crew. And if they turn out to be uh, not so great, so be it. The problem with keeping crew from the beginning until the end is they get very expensive and even if their stats aren't that good you still have to pay a lot of money for them like he's going to go for level four level five level six level seven level eight whatever but his stats are still not that good for a level four guy so we're going to keep on you know what we're going to work on his research his research is terrible oh here come the reviews whoa nine nine all right Ten. Ooh. And a 9.5. Look at that. All right, where's my scores? Where's my scores? Uh, no, no, no. Aha, 9.5. Hey, Green 2. Congratulations, Hey, Green 2. You are a proud owner of 10 Shen points. Enjoy them. Cherish them. They are precious. All right, Chris, do you need any work? Uh, Chris is pretty good all around. Uh, he's my design guy. But you know what? A little more research never hurt. Oh, right. This was a self-published game. Oh, I forgot. I thought it was a, I thought it was a published contract, but it wasn't. It was a self-published game. Oh my God. These people are terrible. We paid five, we paid $510,000 to look at garbage. No. Fuck this. I'm just going to pay 20K. Find me someone for 20K. 
I paid 500 I paid 510k and they showed me level one guys like what what a joke level two no <laughs> find me someone cheap I'm not even gonna justify that with anything all right I've been playing Napoleon the giant and have tremendously enjoyed the experience this game doesn't tell you a story no it manages to draw you in so that you truly feel part of an adventure to distress bacon keep the hits coming please all right, I will try. Get a game report going. 9.5, pretty good for that game, huh? Uh, I think this guy has to go for some tech. He's just terrible. Level two, level two. What is with all these level two piece of shit idiots? Uh... We need a tech specialist. Let's make this guy a tech specialist. Chris is obviously... You know what, Chris? Why don't you do some research? Branching story. There you go. Give me a level 3 guy. That's a level 1. That's a level 2. Give me a level 3. Please. That's a level 2. That's a level 1. What is with this crap? A little more research never hurts. Easter eggs. All right. Multiplayer. Multipass. Ah, oh, looks like we're gonna have to take one of these morons. Oh my god. Oh my god, they're so bad. Oh, they're terrible. We'll go with this guy. Oh, why did I hire you? <laughs> oh, let's do some contract work. No, 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 not a custom. Contract work. Contract work. Get people working together as a team. Oh my god, these guys are bad. Hopefully we can throw everyone on vacation so they'll be on the same... Oh, 4 million from Napoleon the Giant. Not bad. A little more contract work, please. Anything interesting? Uh, tough to do? Nothing really tough. I just want to do whatever gives us the most research because I want four more research so we can do one more thing. There we go. Oh, we have to wait. Okay. I'll wait. No worries. You have to pay money to get better people? Okay, Lucas. Then why is it... Every time we did the 500k, we got crap people. We got level 1s and level 2s when we did 500k. The same as doing 20k. You know? It feels like a waste of cash. Stereo sound. There you go. A little more contract work, please. Oh, the Vena gear is being taken off the market already? Nobody likes the Vena gear. Uh, small boost, fine. And time for a new engine. Alright, what do we got? Branching story, multiplayer, dialogue tree, easter eggs, better AI, day and night. We've got a lot of stuff going in here now. 600k, we're going to call this the... Golden goose. Because it's going to lay a whole bunch of golden eggs. Or it's going to stink up the nest. Either way, it's all good. Manuel. Uh, a, an internal coding contest. Sure. Why not? It just boost people's stats. It's unfortunate that they stop whatever the hell they're doing, which really sucks. But, whatever. Wow. Man, am I glad we paid for G3 when we don't even have a game on the market right now. Whatever. 100,000 fans, not bad. Did not make it in the top 100 boosts. To be expected, though. Vena Gear not supported. Ah, oh, poor Vena Gear. So what do we want to make with the Golden Goose engine? We'll probably make another play system game. Play system is just really good all-rounder. Let's do an action game next. An action game for everyone. 
Let's see. What's good? Alternate history. Aliens. We don't have aliens. Cyberpunk. Don't have it. Dungeon. Don't have it. Fantasy. Don't have it. Horror. Don't have it. Hunting. Don't have it. Wait, did we get hunting? We might have taken hunting. If we can get the hunting action game for everyone, that'll work. Uh, if not hunting, then what else do we have? Uh, military is sort of okay. Chris Malley won the contest. Good for you, Chris. Mm -hmm. Racing is sort of okay. Prison is sort of okay. They're just not amazing. Sci-fi. I don't think we have sci-fi. Space. Sports action. Uh, superheroes action. Alright, everyone on vacation. Then we make a new game. You want to start training your stupid skills, you stupid man with your stupid plan? Oh, God, these guys suck. Just terrible. Uh, yeah, do a little game of gems. A little more contract work, please. Prison? Uh, prison's sort of okay for everyone. We kind of want to focus on everyone category. I'd rather hit something that's uh, three stars instead of just two stars, if possible. Something quick. There you go. Vampire works. I think we're going to do either superheroes, space, or vampire. Yeah. All right, new game. Oh, my, let's do a sequel. Oh, yeah. Let's see. What did we have back here? What was interesting? Where's my vampire games? Where's my vampire? There's a vampire game. All right. We're going to sequel that. No, we can't sequel that. Army Reserves, Time Man. Ah, here we go. Bloods and Crips. <laughs> uh, we're going to make it an action game on the play system with the Golden Goose Engine. Medium game for everyone. So we need a name for a vampire action game. Uh, sequel to B and C. Straight out of Cryptville. Straight out of Krypton instead of Compton. Yeah, that's fine. Let's do it. Vampire action game. Let me just double check. Everything's good here. Vampire action for everybody. And the play system is great and great. Oh, this is going to be perfect. It's going to be perfect. Except that Colton sucks. Fuck you, Colton. <laughs> like, you only paid 20k. Yeah, that's because I don't like you, Colton. Okay, action games are maximum, almost max, and almost min. Yep. So we're not going to be able to fit a whole lot of story and quests. Uh, probably just the cutscenes. You don't really need a story for an action game, do you? Nah, cutscenes are fine. Okay. Engine and gameplay, everything fits just fine. Perfect. So who's going to do the work here? Uh, Chris is doing that. Chris can definitely do whatever he wants because the dialogue is not important here. Uh, we're going to need someone who's good at tech for the AI. Who's good at tech? Dennis. All right, Dennis, don't work too hard. He's probably fine, though. Yeah, 45. Yeah, Dennis is fine. So he can do that there, and then he can do the AIs. That'll be everything that Dennis does. Uh, Chris, why don't you do the story and quests? Yep, that works. And then Manuel can just sit on his hands and do nothing. And Colton is terrible, so screw off Colton. Sorry. I hate you, Colton. Manuel and Colton are just dragging this team down, I tell you. They are just awful. Minimum. Mm, almost max and max. Like that, except who's going to do the design? Maybe Manuel? Hmm. Maybe Chris? No, nah, Manuel can do it. All right, that works. Can we fit anything else in here? Well, we can't fit all that. All right, just better dialogues is fine. Everything else looks good. Uh, Manuel, Dennis, go for it. Hype that shit. I said hype that shit. I said hype that shit. I said hype that shit. All right, now they're getting some hype, see? 
If only G3 was out now instead of right before we made the game. Colton hates me? That's okay. Colton can hate me all he wants. I don't care. Uh, medium, max, almost max. Like this? Like this. Yeah, that works. And Jeremy Mustard, you're going to do all the work. That's fine. Everything fits just fine. Perfect. Oh, man. Everything just fits. It's beautiful. Let's do it. Oh, you want to do an interview? I love interviews. What do we want? Graphics or dialogues? Well, definitely graphics. It's a fucking action game. Why would you focus on dialogues? Hey, man. You got a stick of gum. Wow. Did you see him when he asked that guy for a stick of gum? It was amazing. The dialogues in that action game were awesome. All right. Get those bugs out. Hey, records on both. Gotta love it. 3D V3. Can we afford it? You bet your ass we can afford it. Alright, here comes the reviews. Nine. Ten. Oh. Eight. Okay. And eight. So we got an... Is that an 8.75? Yes, that's an 8.75. All right, let's see. Who guessed that? Aha. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. uh -huh. M game. E-M-M -M game 221. Good job. You get 10 Shen points. I don't know what they're good for. Uh, I bet if you wad them up, you could wipe your butt. But that's probably about it. Congratulations. Hey, 100, 100K sales in the first week. Not bad. Distress Bacon has recently sequeled their game Bloods and Crips. The newest game in the series, titled BIC2, Straight Outta Krypton, was met with outstanding responses. Critics praised BIC2, Straight Outta Krypton, had a newer engine than the original, really driving technical innovation. I agree. It was amazing. Nintendo announced their gener... Next generation console, the TES-64, expected in the coming months. It was the world's first gaming console to support 64-bit processors, blah, blah, blah. Probably not going to be so popular. I say that because I know. Uh, do we want to do some more training? We probably should. We could also get boost. Oh, but it costs a million bucks. Oh, he doesn't have enough points. Okay, well... Keep on getting those points then. Aha! Ladies and gentlemen, the surprise hit of the year is BIC2 straight out of Krypton by Distress Bacon. I have rarely seen such a response responsive game control. It's a true joy to play. But it's only rank 14. If it's the surprise hit of the year, it should be better than rank 14. I'm just saying, God. More tech for you. Yes. Do you need any research, any training? Yeah, sure, get some training. And, oh, Colton, I hate you. At least he generates research points. Five hundred k in sales, not bad. game convention. Well, I would love to get a bigger booth, but I think it's unreasonable. Alright, need a new game. Uh, play system again. Let's do another RPG. What's good for an RPG for everybody category? RPG, RPG, Alien, Alternate History, Cyberpunk, Detective, Dungeon. We don't have a lot of these. Fantasy, we're missing that. Fashion, we don't have it. Uh, martial Arts, Medieval. Why do we not have these? Mystery, post-apocalyptic, pirate. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do... Do we have sci-fi? I don't think we have sci-fi. Spy doesn't really work that great. Time travel. <gasps> Time travel. Time travel. All right. Finish it up, Dennis. Come on. Fucking hell, Dennis. You take forever. Sequel. Where's my last pirate game? Pirate game. Pirate game. Pirate game. I mean, not pirate. What the fuck am I talking about? Pirate. No, 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 no. Time travel. Where's my last time travel game? Time travel. Time travel. Time travel. Where are you? 
Where are you, time travel? What have we done? Where's the time travel garbage? Holy shit. Uh, time travel? Did we not? Oh, there he is. We find Time man, right! We haven't made one in forever. <laughs> uh, time travel RPG. Uh, yeah, works well. On the play system, of course. The Golden Goose scenario. Uh, for everybody. Yep. Need a name for our time travel game. Time Splosion. Call it Time Man 2. <laughs> time Man 2. More Time Man. <laughs> yes! More Time Man. <laughs> Oh my god, this generic name is just perfect. I love it. Okay, let me double check the, the, the category here. Time travel for everyone. Yep, looks good. Uh, play system. Yep, looks good. And RPG. Let's do it. Graphics V2. And then after this, we're going to build our new engine with the 3D V3. The reason I did a game right now is because we're going to get a bunch of free hype because we have G3 coming up. So I figured we might as well capitalize on the free hype, uh, if possible. All right, let's take a look at RPG. It is almost minimum, almost max and max, like this, like that, and like this. Do we need dialogues? We need dialogues. All right, so who's going to take Chris's place? I guess it's going to be Manuel. That works just fine. Yeah, that's good. Unfortunately, Manuel is not great, but hey, he's getting better. He's not as shit as he used to be. Manuel, you are not as crap as you used to be. What happened? What happened? Somebody set us off the bomb. Um, okay, well, we don't need save game, I guess. RPG with no save game. All right, we'll squeeze the save game in. There you go. <laughs> uh, can we get the cutscenes and linear stuff? Okay, there we go. Cutscenes, everything fits. All the good stuff fits. Beautiful. Uh, that looks good to me. Dennis Habibis, you want to do that? Yeah, Dennis is my main man. Do we need AI? No. Okay, yeah, Dennis, you're doing it. Let's go. Come on, G3. Oh, the, G the T64 was released. It's fine. The TES was... Uh, what's the TES good for? G T64. It's actually not good for anything. It's kind of okay for action and casual games, but that's it. It's just not good at anything. Hey, 120,000 people showed up. That should boost our hype by what? By eight? Really? Our hype only went up by eight from G3. Wow, that's kind of silly. Okay, next up is max, almost max medium. Well, ah, we can fit everything, good. So who wants to do these? Dialogues, of course. And then 40 and 20. Well, who's my 40-20 guy? It's probably going to be Manuel. I mean, not Manuel. Uh, Dennis. Yeah, 40, 20. Yeah, that's fine. Everything fits, so let's go. Mark it. Mark it. Mark it. Market. That's enough. <laughs> hey, 8.3 million from BIC2 straight out of Krypton. Nice. Holy poop. Next up is max, almost max medium. Excellent. And we fit everything in? Yeah, everything fits in. Beautiful. Man, these RPGs, everything just fits. I love it. We should make more of these. And Jeremy's going to do the last phase because he's the best at everything in the last phase. Well, let's go. Should get about 100 hype, maybe a little more. All right, stamp out those 39 bugs, my friends. They are not your friends, they are my friends. Alright, the bugs are gone. Time Man 2. More Time Man. Set records for everything. Beautiful. Advanced cutscenes. Alright, research. What do you want to research? Yeah, advanced cutscenes. Okay. And uh, do we want to do some more training? Yeah, why not? 
Hmm. Yep, get some tech. Get some tech. Get some design. Get some game dev gems. Here comes reviews. Eight, okay, I can handle that. Eight, okay. Ten, whoa, that was surprising. And another ten, what the fuck? What, what game were these guys playing? Like, I don't like RPGs. <laughs> what the fuck? Anyway, who guessed 9.0? Someone had to guess 9.0, right? Let's see, score that. Yep, the first person who answered, Arist. 9.0. Good job, Arist. You get 10 Shen points. Casual games are popular. Okay. Is there a system out that's good for casual games? Play system is terrible at casual games. What about the 64? Oh, there we go. The TES 64 is good for casual games. Okay, we'll do that. Maybe. Oh, the sale's not that good. Ugh. But hey, a million dollars, I'll take it. Hey, 100,000 fans, nice. A million dollars from the first week. Rank six game. Give me that game report. And it's time for a new engine with 3D V3. There are a lot of good surprises waiting for you in Time Man 2, more Time Man. The attention to detail in the world in world design really sets this game apart from others in the genre. Rarely will you see rarely will a game captivate you as much. Cool. Thanks for the kind words, whoever you are. That was really nice of him to say that. Oh my god, Dennis, you suck so much. New engine. Alright, 3D V3. And I think I will include the the 3D V2 graphics just in case we need them. I don't think we're gonna need them, but I'll include it anyway. Advanced cutscenes, good, good. And that's it. So the only thing new is advanced cutscenes and 3D V3. Okay, we need a new name. Golden Goose definitely turned out to be what we made like we made like $15 million just on Golden Goose Engine. That's amazing. Savory cupcake. You got it. Hope you enjoy cupcakes. We'll give everyone a break after this, except maybe Colton. Aha! A friend of mine is greatly involved in an organization which claim which aims to get more women into technology. Sure, why not? We don't have any women here, but whatever. We'll give him 60k. Come on, Colton, get stressed. Colton, get stressed. He's not gonna get stressed. Colton, get stressed. He's not gonna get stressed. Colton, I hate you. The Super TES no longer supported. Damn. These systems, they're just vanishing off the planet. Hmm, is there any research to do? Nope. Hmm. I guess we do some training. Five million from Time Man 2. Not bad. Training. There you go. Hmm, more tech. Yeah, more tech. You know what? Actually, you need some speed and research. Can we do that? Get some speed and research. You need... No, you're good on those. Um, more tech. Mm, more everything. God, you suck, Colton. And you just need some tech. Well, just go for both. Might as well upgrade both. We recently got word that Distress Bacon has recently sponsored. Oh, we have, we have got word. Wow, the, that's terrible. We have got word that Distress Bacon has recently sponsored a highly praised move to get more women into technology roles. Jeremy Muster, the CEO of Distress Bacon, said we would love to see more women in the game industry, namely when we install a stripper pole over there in the break room. But uh, until then, I guess sure, have 60k. <laughs> Come on with your stupid train. Colton! Colton, get stressed. 
Colton gets dressed. Colton. 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 Colton gets dressed. Damn you, Colton. I hate you. More speed. Mm, more everything. More tech? Yeah, more tech. More everything. More speed. What the fuck, Colton? I really want to send you on vacation, Colton. God, I hate this guy. Colton has a high resilience. <laughs> there we go. Finally. Look at that. Finally. Like, okay. I guess. Oh, time for convention. Yeah, small boost fine. Okay, you guys ready for vacation? I bet you are. Let's do some contract work? Sure. Just some easy stuff. I don't really care. We'll just get research points in the meantime. Vacation. Vacation. Oh, they don't get any points if they need a vacation. Interesting. That was a waste of training if he doesn't get any points. Hmm. Oh well. GG. We should go to a medium booth next time. Because we have over 100,000 people showing up. 142. Not bad. Didn't make the top 100. That's okay. Hey, it's a new office time. Oh, no, no, no. It's not new office. It's new computers. Yeah. Fancy black machine. Look at that. Desktop black box machines. Oh, mine's in the cubby underneath the desk, but close enough. Go on vacation, Cor Colton. Corton. New training. Okay. The G3 training costs 15 research instead of 5 research. So the 5 research is still pretty good. Uh-oh. The Dream Vast is coming. Oh, yeah. What a terrible system. I mean, no, no, no. Dream... The place... What was it called? Fucking... I can't even remember what the fucking shit it's called. Uh, anyway, let's make a new game. What's popular out there? Let's take a look. Platform. Still the play system, but the PC is right there, so we could make anything. Play system, PC, gaming. We can make pretty much any game we want right now. What kind of a game should we make? If we want to make a mature game, put it on the PC. Want to make a young game, put it on the gaming. Want to make an everybody game, put it on the play system. Hmm. Well, we just did an RPG, so let's skip that. Let's do uh, a strategy game? Yeah, we haven't made a strategy game in forever. So let's see if we can sequel a, a military strategy game. Army reserves, military strategy. Bingo, that was a good one. Yeah. On the savory cupcake. All right. Oh, you know what? We're out of time for this episode. Thank you guys for joining me. I have been Shen, you have been you. Next time, come on back. We're going to make a sequel to Army Reserves. I'll see you then. Have a good day.